Hello everybody, we're back here. Uh, damn it, that thing's too loud. Take a little bit from the volume here. Okay, so we are starting again an old OP. The Legend of Zelda. The Wind Waker. <laughs> yeah, was kinda unnecessary to do that, but wow, I want to remake some old OPs. Which that the truth the six first I ever made so yeah it's gonna have um, live on commentary it will be better than before probably and it'll be a 100% run so let's start that crappy so as you can see I don't create the files yet I don't know why you're supposed to do that huh <laughs> now well uh, so let's start with that. Uh, I ask again for Uzumat1 for using the name on it. He let me use, but at the same time, I feel kind of cute a little bit. But yeah, yeah, I take like a month to decide myself if I use Linkus's name again to resemble the old LP and the awesome LP here also. And um, yes, and also for yeah for resimul the old LP. So let's start with that. Our story begins not long ago. There was a young girl, Savi, to the seas on the head of a band of pirates. Her name was Tetra. She was pretty, brash, and brave. Tether and her handsome pirate Satchel explored the vast and familiar seas. One day, on the stop at an island, Tether met a young boy dressed in green. After a series of strange events, the two began traveling together. F they found all the ruins, and the, te the delight of all of Tether once she transformed into a beautiful princess. Her lineage traced back to ancient ruling king that she was princess of the king of Hyrule. Just then, a huge and ominous king appeared. He carried princess out of way. The evil king searched the secret power passed down by the Hyrulean princess. He shamed to take the power and use it himself. The boy chased after him to terminate to save the princess. The boy crossed the seas and climbed the mountains. The journey was perilous. He slayed evil monsters and used the power to become a true hero. After a long and hard adventure, he defeated the evil king. And the beautiful princess Zelda was rescued at last. Later, the two set sail with a brave pirate crew in search of new lands. Yes, they sail together. A uh, so happy pirate Andy. <laughs> oh well. So what did you think of, of my amazing paper cutouts? Oh, look like everything is okay with the, the speed rather thingy. Yeah. Did you guess that Tether was really Princess Zelda? Hey Linkus, you are you sleepy swamby? Okay, so I am a lazy ass again. Why well, every time when I start a Zelda game, uh, Linky is sleeping. Oh, just so weird. <laughs> Stop messing around down there. You're both supposed to be on lookout. You know, it passed an image of him, he's lazy ass, but uh, to tell the truth, I don't. I am a lazy ass and I do nothing he does. So, <laughs> yeah, it's kind of weird. Ha! Huh, some legendary hero you are. Would well, believe you saved me from the evil king. Princess Zelda, you were kneeling at that spot in the sea. I told you to not call me Zelda. That worked just fine before, you know. But enough about that. So, it is where the coast ship is, is set to appear. Stay on lookout for a creepy lucky ship. Are you sure it is a good idea? What about two ships that have gone missing? I say, the coast ship is behind our outfit. That's right, Nico. Every ship it disappears, and uh, all and it's all because of that scary ghost ship. Ghost. I, I would try to do like a, a Jack Sparrow sent for Nico, some sort of it. <laughs> Look, Nico is there. He just uh, watching over the sky. <laughs> just a lazy. Ass. Hey, Tetra. They say to Caesar protect you. Something about the spirit calling the Ocean King. Or just pure like to protect the ships. Unless there's a really is an evil ghost ship. Don't be ridiculous. There's no such a thing as a ghost ship. I bet it's just some parts up to no good. I suppose then there's a bunch of frauds. 
And the remind them there are rules to being pirates. And Link is scratching his eye. I thought that there really is an ocean king anyway. Holy crap. Hey, look! The, fir the air is still chilly. It in the. Yeah, try. That's my essence for Jack Sparrow. Sorry. I say, we take a dollar out of this crap of place. Why be so scared? We're here to see the world, not take the tours. Ship ahoy! Jethro, I can see a ship. Yeah, a ship up ahead. Oh, damn it. Yeah, by the way, today is really cool. I don't know why. No, under 50 degrees here in Brazil is cool. Yeah, when I mean 50 degrees, I mean on Celsius, not on Fahrenheit. It, it, it's, it's the close ship. This water is already the cause. How do you call yourself a pirate? Oh, and you call yourself a pirate? It's just a ship. But it does look like it could be the coast ship. There might be even be a lot of treasures on board. That's it. I'm gonna get to the point of this. Oh my F. God. Again. Tetra. Back here right now. Tetra. Tetra. Ah. Damn it. Now I have to push with my fingers. Wait a minute, I have no fingers! Ah! So other private fairies. Linkusi, save me! Linkusi! I'm fading into a horrible way because the game is glitched by the emulator. Save me, Linkusi! And Lunar doesn't know how to do that on the on the DS. So we have to use emulators. He's such a dumb ass. Oh, sorry. The <laughs> oh, phew, you're weak. You were in the moment, so I thought you were done for. But look like you're going to be okay. I'm a CL, you see? I'm a fairy. No, I'm a blind, you freaky thing. I was fluttering around and found you here. What happened? Uh, what am I? I am a... What? How old are I mean? Oh, wait a minute. What's the ghost ship? What? Ghost ship? Your friend was taken away by the ghost ship? So you're falling after her? And you got separated from your own ship, huh? It's the ghost ship that people have been talking about. They say that twos it takes are never seen again. You want to know more about the ghost ship? Grandpa will know all about it. I lost my memory a uh, long time ago. When I woke up on T's beat, Grandpa rescued me. He is very sweet to have nothing to worry about because he's not a pedophile. I mean, uh, mm, our house is up there off the beach. Come on. Mm, so many beaches. Also. <laughs> oh, you can walk? Take the direction that you want to move with your style. So the first time you're moving on the game, guys, there's a kind of little bit faster than usual but yeah I guess you can get used to it oh hello traveler so your name is Linkusi and I am Oshus and I live on this island and Cielo told me all about what happened to you and I also hear your friend was taken away by the ghost ship and I understand that you want to find the ghost ship and but must not. You must not. But Grandpa, what are you saying? Linkus' friend was carried away. And the poor evil fills the sails of the coast ship. And it runs the sea in search of the victims to capture. And no one has ever escaped from it. And I best to stay far away from that ghost ship. And no. To save out that ship is to seek out your doom and I'm oh, sorry that's the way you have to do something grandpa and oh messy and mmm and you're not going to give up are you and the young people and uh, the old days the young people here more the old people that's the why you were so peaceful 
Ah, I miss those days. Oh, I mean, there is a part to the east of here. A sailor by the name of Lineback should be there, and he'll be waiting to tell you more about the good ship. And look at your map, the arbor is here. And you mean the guy who come to visit him? Why you don't hope to me, you freaky fate? I'm sorry. He asked about he asked about the ghost ship. I remember him. How many lines are going to? How many cents are going to do for Cielo? I go with Linkusi and I show him who he is. It's okay, right, Grandpa? And yes, and I don't see why you can't go alone. And I'm sure you can help Linkusi. No. Thank you, Grandpa. Let's go, Linkusi. You spin me round, round, baby, round, round. I have to sing that with Ciela voice. Dang. <laughs> she always... Oh. She... And she always be in to see that one. And now, Linkusi. And lately, there have been many monsters sighted. <laughs> and I gave it... Oh. And I gave it to you and told you about the lineback. But... Be careful out there. Sorry about you know, so many and end with um, all issues there. I just thought it will, it will be fun since I was doing that on the beginning. What's that rumbling? Another earthquake? So many quakes lately, so many monsters. That's side for sure. And I bet there are even worse things to come. I'm supposed to read that as Ciela, but I'm also too lazy to remember what voice he did for Ciela. Oh, heavens, that quake it broke the bridge again. So many quakes lately. Uh, <laughs> the bridge breaks every time there is a big one. So, another symbol of Zelda game is every time there is a uh, cross-dressed person here. Oh. There is a second way to get to town, Fortnite. Unfortunately, it leads through the fishing cave full of monsters. What to do? Well, wait for the bridge to get fixed, of course. But I have no time. Here, click with that guy. He's gonna, um, uh, he gonna teach you how to get hogs and throw on chickens. You grab the hog and throw whatever place you want to. Ooh, a rupee! Yay! So talk with him. Things are plentiful. You really help me out here. So, so he gave you a rupee. Hmm. What's the? <laughs> Okay, uh, let's read. What's with the dirt look? I think you're cheap sick. Fine then, here's a hot tip. Look at your map, there's a tree on the spot. Go bash it really hard. Recommend that you jot down your map before you forget. No? And also teach you how to use the map. Which I have an easier way to to do with that. Monsters, look how Linkusi. It's way too dangerous. You need some to need something to defend yourself with. I we'll have to go back. So the thing to push your map, just uh, press D pad down to push your map, and with your styles you can draw anything you want. And I screw up over there, but wow, well, I don't care much. So let me go talk with Oshus because he's a lazy as dog. Try to path to the north, did you? Ciela, don't pretend you forget. I told you never to go on that way. I have seen so many quakes lately. The island lately, I think, could see. <laughs> and, and monsters have been seen closer and closer to town. Because she was young ones that gave up north leads to the path is true. But that path will be crumbling with monsters, do not even think of it. I'm sure someone will get around the repairing the bridge. Okay, I have no time for it. Oh, so sorry. Well, Grandpa wants us to stay out of the trouble, but we need to find your friend. The only way to find a sword, if you only found a sword, then you call the show to those monsters. Now we're gonna break pots, because I'm a bad person. Yeah. So let's go inside here on that cave, I'm sure gonna found something. Grandpa used this cave as a star house. I think I remember Grandpa storing a sword back there. Now, how get this door open? I remember the cracks open the door by reading a number on that side. But, but I think it says it's the number of the tree or the palm trees on the on the uh, beach. Sneaky. Sorry. Keep your hands off my figs and please ask for oceans. <laughs> yeah. 
So I guess I don't reach a good 7. For they recognize that as a 7. Okay. So if go here and follow a sword. So see you next time guys. Bye bye.